Well, and you were already popular with the Bolton Wanderers fans, but I think that cemented it today. Did that feel like a special goal? Yeah, it's always special to, to score a goal, but also just in a derby, you know, that's what you want to do as a player. And so just an overall great feeling, I think. We could have stolen it in the end as well, so it's a good point to take with us. Yeah, the fans were desperate for that goal, we all were, and I think it was well-deserved on the second-half performance. Yeah, second half was much, much better, I think. Um, I think the first half, especially the first 20 minutes, we were struggling a bit, you know, there was a lot of scramble, and that's what they were after, you know, they were getting all the second balls. So I think at times, especially in the first half, we, we could have matched them a bit more and just make it a bit of a scrappy game. And, and then as the game settles, we can start playing our own game, which happened in, in the second half. It got a little bit late, but did you keep believing the goal was on its way? It certainly felt that way. Definitely. When I came on, it was just one goal in, in my mind that was, you know, to, to get us up the pitch, you know, to, to try to be a, a presence and, uh, and, you know, get the ball in the box and, and hopefully, you know, equalise and get a goal. And thankfully it, it happened today. And so, um, yeah, it's, it's, as I said, it's a positive point. Absolutely. A quality cross and a quality goal. We've seen it back and I'm sure you look forward to it. It, it was a cracker. Yeah, it was, uh, and, and Will as well, surprising from him as well. So In a uh, nice way. <laughs> in a nice way, yeah, yeah. No, like, he, I, he was high up there and he, he came up with a brilliant cross and I just tried to get in front of my man and, and just get my head around it and fortunately went in and, and yeah, it was brilliant. We saw your goal in training yesterday. That was a bit special as well. Did, did that make you think you were definitely going to get one today? Yeah, it was... It was just, uh, just, just go for it and see what happens. <laughs> um, no, nah, it's you know you always try to train extra and training with, you know, finishing and stuff just to have a bit of a good feeling for the, for the for the next day in, in in the game. So, yeah, it's good. And everybody wants to start games, but the subs have been terrific this year. You've done it yourself against Morecambe coming off the bench, getting a late goal. Back has done it. You've done it today. It's some real goal power, and it must be nice for the team to know that look across, somebody's going to come on and get us a goal. Yeah, I, I was just saying uh, earlier uh, that um, it's a very tight group of players, and the centre forward, you know, you, you talk about goalkeeper unions and stuff like that. The centre forwards are the same. We, we speak about things if we can improve, of, improve on certain things, and nobody's hanging their hats if. If they're not starting, obviously it's disappointing as a player. You want to start every game, but it's a it's a long season with a lot of games, and, and everyone's vital. Uh, and so, yeah, I just I it, my mindset is always if I'm on the bench, just to be ready, stay ready, and, and make an impact when you come on. It felt like we maybe needed to win every game, perhaps, but uh, this still feels at a good point here, given where they are on the table and the, and the way you did it. Yeah, obviously we want to win every game. Um, well, we have to remember that they're, they're on, you know, I think the second or first, so it was it was a tough game. Um, obviously, we have six games left now. Um, you know, you never know in football, but obviously, I think the main thing right now is just to try to get positive results these last six games for the next season, and um, you see you see where that takes us, and, and then for the next season, preseason, we can improve on things and 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 be ready for yeah next season. Just lastly then, you're on back home for two big games against uh, big clubs. You're looking forward to that Tuesday, Pompey and Sheffield Wednesday next Saturday. The good games to look forward to back in our, in our stadium. Yeah, two, two big clubs as well. So um, exciting games to play. And um, it's a good test for us as well to play against these teams. There's big clubs. Uh, so we're looking forward to that for sure.